previously on Five Nights at Freddy's, The Twisted Ones. I will not let you have her. All right, listen up. Our target is William Afton. His present location is somewhere in Fazbear's World Amusement Park. Mission is simple. We enter, take him out. We do know now that we will be dealing with the force that is ready and willing to fight. So get ready for the worst. Serena! Did you really thought your heroic sacrifice would save Charlie? There is no escape from this amusement park. And we will find her. Police! Nobody moves! Hands in the air! Anybody copy? Charlie? Bravo team? Darn this hurricane. Cannot get anyone on the radio. Then that means we are on our own. Seems that way. Gunshots were coming from that direction. Cover my back. I'll lead the way. You do know. He might be waiting there. I know. Just promise me that you will be careful, Fiona. Don't worry, Nathan. I will. done this. We're too late. As a matter of fact, you are just on time to play one very special game. Don't waste your bullets. You will still need them. By the way, Fiona, what a pleasure to see you again. And you brought new friends with you. That's nice. I also have a new friend. But mine was acting very naughty lately. And now has to be punished. So, the game rule is simple. You kill this animatronic, and I let you leave. And if I don't? Well, in that case, your old friend will kill you instead. So, what is it going to be? Her life, or yours? Time to decide, Fiona. I'm not going to play your stupid games. Kill them all!
What's wrong? Are you giving up? I... I don't think I can defeat him. Come. Stand up. Let me show you somebody. I think you remember Linda. Hello, Fiona. Linda, but how can you be here? It doesn't matter how. What matters is, I am here to help you. Once, I was in a similar situation as you are right now. On my own, I would never have been able to defeat that monster. But I found new friends. And together, we managed to stop that beast. Once and for all. Look around you. You are also not alone in this fight. Help her and she will help you in return. And together you will not only be able to stop him, but also Afton himself. Thank you, Linda. Good luck, Fiona. Him. Yes, you did good, Fiona. But with what kind of price? Again, so many good people died. They volunteered for this and knew the risks, as all of us. Don't be so hard on yourself. You're right, Nathan. At least we've avenged everyone whose life this beast took away. Max, Ryan, Eva, Henry, Emma, and all the others. Truth is, he never was a bad person. Afton twisted his mind and turned him into the monster. But thanks to you, his soul is finally free. Now we only have to stop Afton. It will not be easy. I know. But I have you by my side, so we will handle it. Yes. But I'll not be able to help you in the upcoming fight. What? Why? You have to. You are the only one who still gives me strength to move on. Sadly, I will not be able to help you. You must remember what happened that night in hospital. Because you are not really here. 
You cannot help me, because you died that night, trying to save me. And now, he has your soul. While you are just a part of my imagination. It is true. I might not be alive, but I will always be there for you. I miss you, Nathan. I know. I might not be able to help you, but maybe she can. And when time comes, we shall meet again. Up till then, stay strong, Fiona, and don't give up. I will not. And I will set you free. Thank you for your help. We sure work as a good team. And it seems that we have a common enemy. Afton, he has to be stopped. I might know others who are like me, and will be willing to help. Sounds great. We will need all the help we can get to stop Afton. But before we do that, I must find and protect my friend Charlie. She is in a big danger. Sure. Do you know where to find her? Yes. Good then. By the way, my name is Fiona. to meet you, Jessica. All right, then lead the way. I'm not afraid of you. 